Checking back in with the Black and Gold Network here at the tip-off luncheon. We are here with head coach Kyle Recklitz. Coach, day's quickly arriving, just a, what, a week away from the start of the real season. Yeah, a week away, and we, uh, we have, we'll have 30 practices under our belt, a scrimmage and an uh, exhibition game. So can't wait for that home, uh, first game against Chicago State and then the home opener a few days later. Well, first of all, let's talk about those 30 practices. Brand new team to you. You know, what have you seen? What have been some of the highlights so far of, of the practices? Well, I would definitely say the highlight is that they play with a lot of heart. You know, every drill that we do, they're they're trying to get better. They're doing everything they can to um, elevate our team and put us in a position to be competitive. Um, we still have to work on the consistency of finishing and some drills, but um, you know, they definitely bring it every single day. Excellent. Like I said, as, as a new coach, you bring a new offense, you bring a new defense. So how has that been going over with the girls and, and how they've grabbed a hold of that? Well, it's been a lot of learning. Uh, we're trying to get in as much possible before we play uh, at Chicago State on November 9th. But it's, you know, it's everything is new to them. Our, our defensive system, our offensive system, how we want to transition the basketball, uh, it's all brand new. So it, I have to have some patience in it because I know it's not going to look perfect. Uh, but hopefully we'll have it perfect for conference. <laughs> Excellent. So essentially you bring back four starters. You want to talk a little bit about, you know, the Sammy Tuckers, the Angela Rodriguez that you have that experience coming back. Yeah, our leadership has really stepped up. Uh, we have Angela Rodriguez as the two guard, um, and she's been shooting the ball tremendously. Her confidence is up. Uh, she's been looking to score the ball more, which has been very exciting for us. Uh, Sammy Tucker is our workhorse. I mean, she just game in, I mean, day in, day out, she just plays as hard as she possibly can. Uh, and then you have Toit, and I think Toit is going to really um, bring us a lot of minutes this year. She hasn't played a ton in the past but she's been consistent. She has been the one player, I would say, every, like just consistency across the board. So I'm looking forward to the three of them um, really providing with us a lot of minutes. And then uh, we, have, we have some dominating posts in the paint. So if they can continue to step it up, crash the boards, and finish, we should, we should have a good core group. A very young team this year, and I think it was it six of first seven games on the road. Mm -hmm. How do you approach that? Does that you know, how does it affect the game plan going in? It doesn't affect us. We, we, we take every game the same, you know, whether we're on the road or at home. I, I have to admit, we're looking forward to our first game at home on November 14th against Western Michigan. But um, each game, you know, is a chance to come out and compete. And we always talk about, you know, did you give your best um, for those 40 minutes? And, you know, we'll evaluate after each game whether, you know, we brought it. Win or lose, it's whether we brought it as a team. So when it does get a chance for this to have our first home game and the fans come out to see your team, what are they going to you know, take from that game when they, after they, the game is over? Well, hopefully they'll leave with a sense that, that we have a great team effort. You know, everybody comes together and, and that we're constantly bought into each other. Uh, they'll also see a fast-paced game. We're going to transition. Uh, we're also going to pick up our defense with some denial. So I think the atmosphere is going to be really good. It's going to be exciting to watch. And you'll see a lot of energy and enthusiasm coming from our bench and on the court. Excellent. Then one final question for you. It's been about five or six months since you've taken over the position. How's Milwaukee been treating you? Oh, Milwaukee's been great. Uh, you know, bringing my husband and, and my daughter here um, so he could be closer with his family has provided us with a great support system. Uh, and the community has been so supportive. I mean, I've had, uh, you know, lots of lunches with fans and boosters, and it's just been great to get to know everybody around the Milwaukee area. Well, excellent. Well, thanks for your time today, and good luck. Yeah, thank you.